Welcome to another episode on On and Underwater. Where in today's video we pick kangaroo meat versus emu meat. See what actually catches the most Australian fish. But it doesn't go quite to plan, does it? <laughs> Not even remotely. How are we judging who the winner is? Is it the biggest fish? Mongrel fish, I hate your guts! That means no, don't try and make me win! It was the literal monster! <laughs> but at least we get to eat the most Australian burger ever made, because it has a very secret ingredient. Wait, secret ingredient? You're just going to have to wait to the end of the video to find out what it is. Yeah. Sorry, buddy. The best thing of my life is fishing for fish. This is the best day ever, because I have James's party if you're watching this right now. And then we could actually get to the fish. Before we get out there, really quick, there's something you haven't seen or haven't noticed, and you haven't seen yet. You're the only one in the family who hasn't. Look, just look up. And that's how far she goes back. And also, she goes this. literally to exactly where we wanted her to. And now you've got some shade. I'll be honest with you, I feel like you forgot about it. Just other way, you gotta do it, that's it. Now that's bringing it in, go for it, it's hard. All right, well how about uh, we get rid of these uh, clears so you can see when we go out and let's get out there. Yeah? Yep. All right. <laughs> get out there is we do paper scissors rock and whoever wins chooses what they want to fish with. I want kangaroo. What's oh. going to be the consequence if you lose? Uh. I've got one. But You know what sucks at the end of every time you take your boat out? Uh, parking it? Cleaning it. <laughs> oh. Whoever loses cleans the boat by themselves. The loser scrubs the boat, the winner gets to eat the burger. There you go. I haven't had breakfast yet. Have you had breakfast? I mean, I, was in, I went to bed at 1am because I thought it was a smart idea. <laughs> oh well, let's get out there. So whose team are you going to be on today? Dad. Dad, alright. So hopefully we don't have to clean the boat. Wait, did my brother just ditch me? Yeah, he did. Sorry. <laughs> So we've made it to our area now. Today is the only day we can fish in between work, school, and everything else. And as you can probably tell, the conditions, well, aren't the best. Yeah. They're not oh, awesome. It's lot. But there's a lot of chop, there's a lot of wind. But hopefully, mate, we can catch some fish. What do you think? Yeah. We did fish in the rain last time, didn't we? On the right we? side, if we don't, we got kangaroo here. That is <laughs> correct. So just so you know, Carlos kept these meats separate, so one's emu, one's kangaroo. They're both a red meat. Emu? Emu? Kangaroo. Kangaroo, gotcha. Who's going to be what? You want to do paper, scissors, rock? Ready? The winner I chooses. I really choose. The winner chooses. Out Ready? Three? Yeah, go one, no, but out of one. Well, there's like. Out of one. Out of Here we go. Paper, paper, scissors, rock. I win, baby! I love paper! <laughs> Sam, do I win or does he win? Uh, He's getting on! Because <laughs> no, if, if, if it's floating. No, don't try and make him win. <laughs> don't suck up. I'm Sam, taking the five. kangaroo. Alright, so you're kangaroo. So you're kangaroo? Yes. So you're this side of the boat. You bet. You're kangaroo. I'm and I am emu yeah. this side. Alright, okay. How are we judging who the winner is? Is it the biggest fish? Uh, or is it the best tasting fish? Nah. Or the biggest fish? I said biggest fish. Biggest, biggest fish. fish. You got something? Yeah, I'm You sure? Keep it coming. It looks like there's a bit of fight going on. What do you got? You got something? First biggest rock. Call. First fish. Well, guess what? You're winning the fish thing so far. And let's measure him so we know his uh, his size. Yeah. Yep. All right. Got him. There you go. He's freaked. Ah! And I couldn't even measure him. Sorry, buddy. But guess what? You're winning. <laughs> well done. What do you think? Final casting will move. Because so far, you're the only one who's caught something. I haven't had a bite yet. Okay, have you had a bite? So Kanga hasn't had a bite, but Emu's caught a fish, but I haven't caught any. So I decided we're actually going to be heading back down to the club. We're going to get away from this wind, get into the, hopefully, the weed, and hopefully at least we can catch a butterfish. And to be honest, I thought I'd never say that. Got a hoodie. Yeah, make it nice and warm. It's freezing out here. So now this is our time to shine. Maybe. Now, we've got to shine, because we've got to beat Kangaroo. You're winning. The problem is I haven't caught a fish yet, so between you and I. No, we're teaming up. I'm telling It might be a bit better, just because there's no reeds. So if, if you wanted to, there's more reed in front of us if you wanted to go further in and the less drift out. It's the first fish you've caught. No, there's nothing on there. Is it blowy? No, there's nothing on there. It's a blowy. 
Well, technically, you're still winning, mate, because that's the biggest fish. Fish on for Sam. What do you got, Sam? Just try to get it up. Oh, you got something. Is that a rock cod? It looks like a rock cod to me, and it is the biggest rock cod. It was bigger than your first one, Sam. You five. Oh, you can't give me five. <laughs> it's, it's a big one, mate. Right. So what do we got? He is 22 centimeters, all right? You're winning, mate. Two zero. See you, buddy. He's off. Mate, seriously, well done again, mate. Two fish for you. Zero, f oh, well, technically a I'm blowy. blowy. And I have nothing. Come on, bite it. Take it, take it, take it, take it. I've got to have one fish today. Hard, got him. But none of them take it. Fish on. Uh, you're kidding me, are you? Stop chewing on it, you stupid fish. Mongrel off. fish, I hate your guts. <laughs> you're not supposed to be laughing at me. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Fish on. What have you got? What have you got? Oh, it's a butterfish. I hate butterfish. Butterfish. Well, oh, baby. Butterfish. Oh, take it. Let's measure him because yours was how big, Sammy? 22 centimeters. Six. What have we got? 21. 21. Ah, ah, ah. Nah, nah. His nose isn't even down the end of it. Push his nose all the way down the end. Oh, he doesn't want it. 21. So. Actually, he's still oh, bigger than on. mine. Go on, Sam, I've got to get this done. You're, you're, you've got the biggest fish. You've got the most fish, because we don't count blowers. We have to call it quits soon, too. Got something bigger on the bottom. Big fish. Big fish? Big fish, Dad. Yep. Dad. Yep. Oh, dude. It was, it was the literal monster. I have actually got two herring. <laughs> Does my monster count? Oh, look at that, Sam. I don't have the biggest fish, but I have the tastiest. So to be, to be clear, um, I know our competition was between you and I, but currently Emu is kicking kangaroo's ass. How long though? But yeah, good pull, pull. He's got your herring. What a got big, Sam? big herring. You need a couple of fillets out of that, mate. Well, you win. You've caught the biggest fish. Hey. Um, you didn't catch it. Didn't I bring it on the it. boat. You didn't catch it and you keep didn't it on get the, the boat. Net. You didn't keep it on the boat. It was a leather I jacket. Didn't, teach didn't you catch. Better. But regardless, I teach you, better. you got a butter fish that's 22 centimeters. I got two herring that would have been around about 15. And so I you win. Had a leather back. Yeah, but you didn't. 35. But you didn't. It you fell off. The ball. Yep. Right. All right, Sam. I'll hang on. Maybe get your brother to hand you your uh, or iPad to you here. Actually, you're a huge boy. I'm not joking. That's why he's your big brother. He's not a big brother. Brianna he is. is a big brother. Brianna's a big brother. <laughs> She's big and she's older and she's better than everybody. But, but she's not your brother. Oh, yes. right, you know. And hoi All right, enjoy your birthday party. You One of those days I get to clean the boat. Smashed my face. Didn't catch as many fish. Got the smallest fish of the day. And I get to clean the boat. And I get to not eat. And I get to cook for my son. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Let's get this boat cleaned up. Yeah, buddy. No problem, mate. Well, I've literally cleaned up the boat and I'm just about to tell them all what I'm going to be cooking for you. And I've got a special ingredient, mate. <laughs> all right, so Caleb's on his way back. So what is my plan? Obviously, because I lost today, I have to cook uh, the most Aussie burger I possibly can. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be cooking up a slab of emu, a slab of kangaroo, a piece of the herring that I'm going to ask, I'm hoping Caleb to be able to fill it. Then I'm going to be adding cheese, butter, and the special ingredient is going to be Vegemite, which is obviously something we normally put on toast in the mornings. But I thought, let's make this burger as Australian as possible. And I actually don't think anyone's ever done this before. <laughs> Caleb doesn't know yet. Is that what I think that is? What's that? It's a, it's a half cleaned boat. Special ingredient for your lunch today. Oh, wait, found it. Still on its pack. There you go, buddy. She's actually come out, um, he's a pretty good filler now, would not he? Well well, I didn't know you had one. Ah, well done, got a bit of a bone in the corner here, but you cut that. But that, mate, well done. Ah, seriously, well done. So I'm going to cut half it. Um, 
not going to cut. I didn't even go through the middle. Long strips? Or short? That might be better because it'll cook better because we don't have an oven. So I'll do long strips for you. It's a lot redder than I thought it was going to be. Amy? It's dark red. It's a lot redder. So I'm going to cook it up, then I'm going to cook the roll on the actual. Um, I'm you get, the roll oh, up. so you're going to. Aren't you getting olive oil on it? Yep. I'm going to heat the roll up at the end. Oh, okay, yeah. You know, in the so you're going to toast it? Bring in, yep, each side. So I'll toast that so it's ready to go. Then we're going to have cheese, butter, and then we're going to be having our emu and everything else. Mate, I'm a bit worried about this being on it, but yeah. I have to admit, I'm actually looking forward to this. Emu. We're going to have three strips of emu. Kangaroo hamburger. Well, this is making me hungry, mate. Of the biggest herring we've ever caught. Thank you, Samuel. Sorry, buddy. Just a little bit of garlic salt to for you. All right, just so you know, everyone knows I'm using um, uh, unsalted butter, so you know. Do you want Vegemite on one or both sides? You know when you bite into it, do you want Vegemite on, the, on your tongue or on your palate? Or both? Say so both. Both. Good answer. <laughs> Good answer. Oh, did I tell you? What? Trish got back to us at Boston Whaler. Tr wait, wait, Trish, Trish from Boston Whaler, yeah, the factory Boston in like Whaler. America. Remember I sent them an email saying, oh, we'd love to come for a tour in Florida. We live in Perth, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're going to YouTube in October, yeah, yeah, routine. They've said, yes, we can come for a tour. Wait, they guaranteed it? Yes, they said <laughs> we can come for a tour, but I have told them, look, small YouTube channel, we have no idea what we're doing, and Trish, <laughs> Trish knows who we are now. Um, and obviously she knows we're not super, super bony. But yeah, we're gonna get a tour of where Boston was born. I'm looking forward to that. Just so you know, all the Americans are in this watching, you can't spread Vegemite on dry toast. It doesn't work. Like, it doesn't spread. You have to have butter, enough of it, so then the Vegemite can mix with it. You know what, on top of that, the only thing I've noticed is everybody from the US has never known how much they're meant to actually put on. Yeah, they do add, you don't add a lot. Like Some a, people you don't, do. You don't put a spoonful nah. of Vegemite in your mouth. And you That's can't just eat odd. a spoonful either. Some people think you can eat it like um, peanut butter. Nah. Definitely not. Beautiful. All right, mate, do you want your burger medium rare? I mean, sorry, didn't go to Pearl and get a plate. Um, well, I have an idea that you may not like. You're looking at the lid to the bucket, aren't you? I am. You mean the one that's got the guts on it? No, not, and... it has not got the guts on it anymore, look. There are literally a- I'll clean there's it! There's literally a I'll, blood stain. I'll clean it. Okay. That was like a five-star Michelin restaurant plate. Serving. Serving, buddy. Serving. All right. I'm going to have to serve it up now. All right. Look at that. Oh, beautiful. All right. See, buddy, I will spread the Vegemite on. Don't overdo it. Now, How much are you putting on? Here, look. Look, I'm going to try and spread that's it. all you literally need. Yeah, that's it. Look, look. Just the flavor, people. Just the flavor. Two strips of emu? Yep, two strips of emu. Yeah. Some of the best fish you'll ever catch. Kangaroo burger. I like this. Yeah, there. Gave the cheese yeah. some time to melt. Oh, all right. Mm. It's good. Yeah. Weird. Good but weird. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's the cheese. Yeah. You can taste the meat, but afterwards it kicks in with veggie mite and herring. Yes. Mate, that is so much better than I thought it was going to be. Right, I'm going to clean this up now. Dad, you're doing a good job, but um, you missed the spot. <laughs> oh.